It's been about a week since we last looked at the dock in Kingston, and there have been some significant changes. Considerable work has been noted recently in building the forms that will contain the concrete for the ramp towers. And this is where it was all headed. Before we focus on the concrete pour, let's have a look at some of the work at the end of the finger dock where piles are being driven in. It's well worth noting here that the massive rigs involved in driving these piles come from a Canadian company, Birminghamer, who are world famous for their pile driving technologies and now part of the Solitange Batchi Group, Canada. Earlier this week it became clear that preparations were well advanced to pour concrete on the towers of the new ramp. On Friday, as the Wolf Islander 3 headed for dock, work was well underway. You get some idea of the scale of the dock when you see humans beside the components. Almost all of the technology in use is impressive. It's easy to overlook the considerable challenge involved in building a dock like this one. We'll finish here today by taking a look down the whole dock, noting the foundation area on the south side, the pumper and the ramp, and then finally, the finger dock where the pile driving will continue, presumably, for some time. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoy these updates, please consider subscribing to the channel. And let's not forget what all this work is about. That's bringing the Wolf Islander 4 into service at the earliest possible opportunity.